Terry, how's it going? Uh, uh, it's cool, man. You know, feeling, feeling all this energy, man, around this election. It's trying to, it's hoping and praying that this all lands. Look, I wanted, I wanted to ask you about that. Look, we're, we're seeing the, the energy level, you know, Biden steps down. It's looking more and more like Kamala is going to be kind of the Democratic choice. You've been really critical of Trump in the past, right? So where are you at on this thing? Um, well, a few things. I was, I was worried, like the rest of us, uh, looking at uh, Biden's health decline, praying for him. And then I was worried about Trump, you know, when, uh, when that attempted assassination on his life happened. That was very, like... A reminder that we're living in some dark times and everything about them over the years going back and forth trying to figure out what to do in and around putting things in place for people that have mental health issues or any type of agenda other than honorable gun owners right because the yeah. guns can't do anything without person that's holding the gun. Look, but you've been really critical of Trump in the past, yeah. right? Then that happens, you know, and you've got, like, I, as we all should, like, empathy for for that situation. Nobody wants to see that happen yeah. to, to anybody, much less a former president of the United States, you know? Yeah, but I, I don't want anybody to confuse empathy with me understanding what is not in the best interest of our country. Trump is a shit show, and... Um, I think what we have to do is we have to never lose sight of how much blood has been shed over all these years from us simply having our legal right to vote as black culture. I understand that when they get up on the stage, the teleprompters, they got the words and they got all the stuff that sounds good. What's the plan? What's the idea? Anybody can give a speech. Anybody as they can say. give a speech. But, you know, I think it's time for us to finally feel and experience a political figure or presidential candidate that's going to actually do the, th the things that they say they're going to do during their presidential campaign, right? Because as much as we want to do what's in the best interest of all Americans, when you wake up in this black skin every day, you can't help but think of the things through the lens of your own experiences. So are you on board with Kamala right now, like fully? I want Kamala to do everything that she's saying that she's going to do for us. Um, no different than we expected Biden. No different than we expect Trump to do all the things that he's saying he's going to do.